practice prepare our uh, work insert your hook and now I am going to work change stitch so it is up to the length of work that you want to create chain once again it is up to the work that you want to create for the beginners I am going to show you how to do chain stitch so just do it for the number of times okay so this many length i have created just for the sample now next is now i'm going to work double crochet from each of this chain stitch so for that chain 2 yarn over and insert your hook from the third chain from this hook 1, 2 and 3 now see here we have total 3 loops so let us complete this first i'm going to work from the first to two loops then yarn over and just do the second one again yarn over insert your hook from the next stitch three loops first two loops again two okay so two double crochet we have completed similarly now insert your hook from the next chain stitch from the previous round oops yarn over first then insert your hook into the chain stitch again from the next stage so similarly work double crochet from each of this next stage So in this way just complete this so here I have finished the second round of this border so this is the last double crochet stitch that I did now next is turn your work like this and from the back side just chain one to secure your work and now from this chain four one two three four chain four and work slip stitch from the third 
double crochet stitch so skip next two stitches from one two and from the third stitch work slip stitch Similarly, chain four, skip next two stitches one, two, and from the third stitch, work slip stitch as you can see over here. Similarly, two, three, four, chain four, and again skip next two stitches one, two, and from this stitch work slip stitch. Chain four, two, three, four. Skip next two stitches and from the third stitch work slip stitch. Chain four, one, two, three, four. Skip next two stitches, one, two, and from this third stitch, this one. Insert your hook So as you can see over here Similarly just uh, do it for uh, all the rows so I am now completing chain 4 skip next 2 and from the third stitch from the third double crochet stitch work slip stitch 1 2 3 4 skip next 2 from the third stitch work slip stitch Two, four, now chain two and this is the last stitch so chain two and work double crochet from this last stitch okay now again turn your work now from here chain two sorry chain three work slip stitch from this piece now chain five two three four okay i think four is also enough no uh, five okay chain five and again insert into the next chain space from the center and work slip stitch similarly chain five two three four, five insert your hook from the next chain space and work slip stitch similarly 4 5 chain stitch insert your hook from the next chain space work slip stitch 2 3 4 5 
four, five. One, two, three, five. Okay, so here I have completed this round. Let us see how it looks. Okay, now next is I'm going to work next round. So for that, currently my work is just uh, completed at this point. So from this now for the next round i'm going to turn my work so chain two chain three work okay chain two more so total chain five work slip stitch chain 5 and work slip stitch again chain 5 3 4 5 chain 5 work slip stitch again chain 5 3 4 5 work slip stitch chain 5 2 3 4 5 work slip stitch chain 5 work slip stitch similarly let us complete this round Chain five work slip stitch chain five work slip stitch chain two work double crochet from this point. So here is uh, what work that I have completed. The uh, this is just uh, that uh, I'm making border for uh, sari dupatta or the same concept. Also, you can apply for uh, making door hanging or uh, for any decoration purpose for the toran or door hanging whatever you like the same concept you can also apply in the circular way as you like so now from here i'm going to change the color so for that chain one and let us skip this yarn okay now from this first point i'm going to take this orange yarn let us secure it Okay, 
now from here chain 2 work 3 times double crochet from this chain space one two and three now chain two and just work slip stitch okay so just to shift your hook from this to this okay after doing three times double crochet shift your hook from the next so for that yarn over and insert your hook from the next chain space and now from here okay I think uh, here I need to work slip stitch or uh, single crochet stitch now from here i am going to work six times double crochet from this chain space again one two three four five six I like to add one more double crochet seven so total seven double crochet I have worked from this now from the next chain space I'm going to work slip stitch so this is uh, or uh, single crochet also you can uh, do it whatever you like now just skip this and from the next chain space again work seven times double crochet so in this way just complete it one two from the same chain space three four five six and seven now from the next chain space from here work single crochet stitch now again skip this one and from here again work seven times double crochet stitch three four five six Seven. now from the next chain space work single crochet from the next chain space again work again work seven times double crochet stitch two three four five six 
six and seven now from here just work single crochet stitch okay uh, this yarn you can cut from here but uh, this is just for the sample I have created this border so this is the border that uh, we have worked so similarly you can work for a different color combination so thank you for watching hope this video helps you for uh, doing this art thank you so much keep watching and uh, keep practicing